Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and let's see exactly what we can get done. Randomize. Ooh, Tainted Cane. See, Tainted Cane's an interesting one because I, I, I've been thoroughly enjoying him the past few times we've played him because we've been working with the new, um, the new, what's it called? Um... I can't remember the name of it now, Molding Clay, but I do need to create a mod to make it more balanced at some point, so I'm not going to do that for now. We're going to do Tarnished Isaac, because I haven't played a Tarnished character in quite some time. We've rolled Tarnished Isaac, um, and I'm pretty intrigued by the Tarnished characters. If I remember correctly, Tarnished Isaac is very, very similar to Tainted Isaac, uh, just that his ways of re-rolling are a little bit different and you can do some funky stuff with the blighted dice to get some interesting so I, I honestly can't remember i'm just i'm just eyeballing and spitballing my understanding right now which is yeah not great so let's just jump in and see what we can do um yeah we were still have limited items i can't remember how the blighted dice works so if i use uh, i can't use this blighted dice oh wait oh wait i think i remember now I pick things up, and I use blighted dice to remove them from myself, right? So, actives don't count for that. Um, but I can I pick, pick things up, and then I can remove them from myself, and it'll remove one and drop two items, and I can pick between the two. That's, that's how I remember, I think. I will go for this regardless. You see, sometimes it goddamn pays out. Gat damn pays out. But honestly, spin to win, not great right now, but I do not mind it. I do not mind it. Also, this is hectic ass room here. Hectic ass room. Uh, anyways, on my uh, on my sort of train of thought from last episode, um, question of the day, what's your go-to sweet treat? What's, what's like something sweet that you are every single time going to go to? I, I, I'm all about the food questions today. I'm all about, I, I say today, I just mean over the next, dude, those fucking stupid bouncy little shits. This one's gonna pop. Ooh, my spin to win just saved me from getting hit there. Thank you muchly, thank you muchly. Right, let's keep it, keep it moving, keep it grooving. Uh, I'd like a bomb, because I'm pretty sure secret room's just to our right here. Let's have a little look here. So, bomb, suffer is blighted dice. Select and then reroll. Yeah, that's exactly how it works. Okay, good to know. So obviously we got an active straight off the bat, so it doesn't really matter. There's a bomb. Yeah, I thought that was there. Hello, hello. Hey, it wasn't a dud bomb either. This is lovely. Quite a lot of cash, Ola. Now, one thing I don't remember with Blighted Dice is if it has any bearing based on the room that you're in. Like, if I take a shop item and then go, to a tr go into a normal room, will it split into two shop items or will it split into two treasure room items? Or will it be two completely random items and it has nothing to do with it? I really can't remember. Quite the room here, quite the room. I like using spin to win just to actually uh, move around a bit quicker. You can use it for contact damage as well, obviously. It's pretty useful for that. Uh, gains the white fire effect while held. I mean, it gives us flight. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We're coming here. And we can come over here. And we can grab... that and then we can go and do that very worthwhile wow that and then we can just drop the trinket oh wait what oh no i've got to complete a combat room in this stair i see okay that's fine that's fine i can do that i can do that just sit over the top of these rocks here you're not a threat to me big b Big I B. And I should be my normal self now. I am good. Okay, pretty good stuff. Um, I completely forgot to go to my shop here. For some reason, I thought it was ahead of me when it's actually behind me. I am a goof. I have done diddly goofed and to the highest degree. Using spin to win to kill those orbs is real goddamn satisfying. 
By the way, just in terms of, you know, like, I've been talking about playing new games, I've been playing a bunch of Diablo 4 recently, it's been an absolute blast. Another game that just came out, the oh boy, is absolutely amazing. Um, if any of you like Battlefield, uh, or even Call of Duty, a game just came out called Battlebit Remastered. Uh, it came out on Early Access, it's like £12, um, it's pretty cheap. And, oh my god, is it amazing. Okay, so let's, I don't really care about this. Let's, uh, let's grab it and we'll, we'll go like that. Range down, great. Okay, so it did split into two boss items. I'm going to have to split that again and see. Right, I'm going back to my shop real quick. Um, but yeah, basically, it's this, it's really, it's a really low poly game. It kind of looks a little bit like Roblox. But, it was made by three people, and it's like one of the most in-depth shooters. It's, it's got so much going for it. It's absolutely awesome. And yeah, it came out like yesterday, and I've been playing it a bunch. And it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Um, why is this item faded? I am confusion. Okay, it didn't give me boss items this time. Um, I'll just take the damage up for now then. Okay, so I pick up another item to charge. I didn't really know that's how that was going to work, but hey her, I guess. Hey her. It is what it is, Humbolia. Um, do you know what? I think this is kind of worth it for now. Keeping keeping the uh, the white fire going for now. We got holy mantle and stuff. It's pretty good. It's gone down. It's a kind of risky trinket, but I like it. You can go to cash rooms for free and stuff. It's it's nice. Got to make sure I don't get hit. Yeah, having the extra damage here is lovely. Lightest dice is charged. Good, good. I don't want to reroll this because it's damage right now. Temperance, okay. We've still got a bunch of money here, so we're good to go in terms of shop. Managed to make you step on yourself, I like that. Another puzzle piece straight off the bat, love that. A stranger will help. I'm going to guess we're getting a familiar then. That seems to be what it's implying, at least. But yeah, the plus one damage now. It's good stuff, it's good stuff. But yeah, I thought taking the flight, extra cash rooms, and then anything that we have to fly for. Also, yeah, we get spectral tears for a bit as well. We basically just turn into the lost while we're holding this trinket, which is pretty darn good, I'd say. Pretty darn good. So it's a good trinket. It's a risky trinket, but it's a good trinket. Um, so we can we can take the Lego Man and then go boom. Oh, wait, what, what the fuck just happened? I'm confused as to what I just did. Why is there three items on the floor now? There should be two. I understand why there's two. Why is there three? This did not work. This did not work how I wanted it to at all. Okay, so they are staying as boss items, these ones. Maybe the flat emblem is a boss item. Whoops. Okay, also, my shot speed is really bad right now. Foul gut will save us, do not worry. Foul gut will save us. I think I also gave myself a broken heart somewhere in there. I'm, I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I'm just going to ignore it for now. I, I just spammed I spammed my uh, active item by accident. I was just trying to use those studs. Didn't really work out the way I wanted it to. Get good poison there. Don't think that really did anything for us. 
Good poison there as well. Okay, good stuff. Got to remember not to get hit here because we either lost. It's okay though. Pretty easy fight there. And we can't take that yet. We... Can we even take the devil deals yet? I'd... Balls. I mean, I don't want that anyways, but still. Okay, I do actually want that, so... Go back. Back to reality. Oh, I kind of forgot about my item room here as well. Falgut is doing some absolute work right now, which is lovely. Grab all those. Clear some of our debt. Rotgut we will take. Lots of HP we got going on right now. It's kind of cool to be the lost, but be able to take advantage of Rotten Hearts. <laughs> I like that. Um, and then we want to go and take this bad boy. And then we want to get rid of this. And we'll take Slick Spirit. Okay. Reasonably happy with how, th how things are going so far. I think we've managed to create a pretty interesting run here. I'm just getting a bit overzealous in that shop, I think. Slick Spade should hopefully provide us with a quite a lot of good stuff as well. It can give us money, it can bleed enemies, it can do all sorts of good stuff. There's a coin caught in this man's grasp. There's a coin in his grasp. Oh no. Take y'all out. Lovely. I like the way that Rotgut moves after every wave here. But yeah, anyways, I was speaking about, speaking about battle bit. Y'all need to go play it if you're into FPS games or into Battlefield, because it is like there's there's like two 127 versus 127 player lobbies, like absolutely like all out huge scale wars. It's it's impressive what they've done. It truly is impressive. But for a, for a three developer team as well. Three developers made it, and it's it's just it's like better than most AAA games that are coming out at the moment, in my opinion. And it's like, oh my god, the industry is so fucked. <laughs> Feels like only passionate in small indie teams are the only like ones that care. Like any sort of AAA game, the devs might care. The studio does not give a single hoot. Not give any hoots whatsoever. Um, so I can get rid of Foul Gut now because I I I have got the Rotten Hearts. Unfortunately, two pretty piss poor items there. Oh God! I didn't realize you'd fire towards me while you were looking away from me. That was spooky, as I'm gonna call it. Spooky. I feared you. Need to remember to to save my uh, broken dice uses until after I've grabbed all the items on the floor. I just want more chances to reroll as well. Okay, good. Extra penny. My god, the flies. The rotten hearts are so beautiful. And get charmed. Oh, you get golded. Oh, really? Really? I killed him while it was gold and it gave me one penny. It's a little low, don't you think? A little bit low, don't you think? Right. One more room. Two pennies. Come on now. Right. Go in here. Check out what's going on in the shop. Two actives, no thank you. And back through here. Secret room's looking to be here, in my opinion. Sadly, it is not. And in here, we've got Libra. I mean, I guess we just take Libra. I mean, Libra gives us a bunch of consumables. Um, and then, yeah, let's get rid of Libra straight away. Pentacles is pretty good and, and actually works because the on-hit effect wouldn't really work for us. Pentacles could could give us some good stuff. Oh, dude. 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 
We have such a god tier synergy that I forgot about. So, spin to win makes blue flies invincible. Meaning they can do ludicrous damage. Like, absolutely insane damage. And they don't disappear. It's, it's, at, like, watch this, watch this. I still got all the flies. I didn't lose any of the flies. Dude, I need to fucking, oh my god. Wait, what, what did I just do? Where'd that item come from? I'm confused. I'm so confused. Oh god, all my items are dog shit at the minute. A lot of my, but this synergy is, is tippity top tier. I forgot how absolutely god tier spin to win was with any sort of fly generation. It's, it's ridiculous how good it is. Basically, you just, as soon as a fly latches onto an enemy, you just tap for a small bit. It's good shit. Prayer card. Prayer card I'll actually just take. I don't, I don't care about prayer card. Um. Why not? Why not? Okay, let's keep this going. We've got all we need to, to win this run. Oh, it works with our Terratoma orbs too. Okay, that was stupid. I tried something, it didn't work. Let's be cautious, shall we? Let's be cautious. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot how insanely overpowered this combination is. You ever get blue flies plus splint spin to win, you have won. Basically, you have won. But for long boss fights, obviously it's not going to be as effective, but room to room combat, it's absolutely broken. Right, what we got going on here? Beautiful. Choose this to move around quicker. Also makes our pentacle um, wisps cheaper too. Okay. I want to keep what I've got for now. I will certainly take that though. Thank you. Right. Oh, last puzzle piece. Last puzzle piece. Didn't even see it. Pandora's box. Oh wow. How joyous. I don't know how to best to effectively play this guy. This, this this is a confusing a confusing character for me. I wasted all my spin to win charge for this room, so I can't do the trick as well. Can you open up, fella? There you go. There you go. <laughs> they just do so much damage. Like, we have low damage as well, remember. Our damage could be a lot higher. Good. Doesn't even matter what items we have for now. I did lose a pent pentacle wisp then, which I shouldn't have. Thought it made him invincible, but apparently not. There we go. Move through the room like this. Let my flies do everything. Get them all invincible up. And we've still got spiders galore as well. That was just very satisfying, wasn't it? 
Now we do have the opportunity for perfection now. I don't think we have anything that scales off of perfection. Another puzzle piece coming our way. Puzzle piece. Um, I think we just get rid of the HP. And, ooh, 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 okay. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to gulp it. And then I'm going to give this, we're just the lost now. Like, we're just the lost with a new gimmick. Or GMO corn. So I think basically what I'm doing there is if I use broken dice while it's not charged, it gives me a broken heart but trades an item. I can do that up to 12 times because I'm the lost. Uh, it doesn't actually give me broken hearts. So I've, I've got to be somewhat careful. Okay. Keep it going. So now we're basically just the lost. White pepper, I'm just going to take to charge up this. And then I'm going to go like that. And I'm going to take that. Not getting great items here. I will pay into you, my good lad. Ooh, soybean thing? I kind of like that, actually. I'll, uh... I'll try and keep that. Uh, let's, we, we should probably get a charge before we do all of this. Some good stuff in here. Some real good stuff. I think we can only take one is the only problem. What the fuck? There's a crawl space in this crawl space. Okay, come back. Ah, oh, bloody hell, use the key when I didn't need to. My bad. But yeah, flies are doing significantly more damage now. We're up to 5.23. So I like that bigly. Ooh, that's good, but I'll stick with what I've got. It's actually not good for our, our current situation anyways. Oh, it's not great at least. Good, good. Dice room there, I'm not that intrigued by. Don't like a room with just all enemies. That's not great. Look upgrade, thank you. Right, we've got a charge now so we can head our way back. We're going to come down here. We're going to take the soybean. Um, we can just take that. And then in here, we've got choices. I think cyst is the best one. We will trade cyst for this, I think. Yeah, the rest of them did disappear. And then I'm going to trade the speed upgrade for... Unfortunately, just two of those. Not great. Right. Oh, that was big oof there. Right. And then we go. So, basically, my thinking here is, are my flies going to be ludicrous damage-wise now? I think they are because of cyst giving us insane damage on entering a room. Do my flies have insane damage? L l let me try something first. I think I need to generate new flies so that you get updated with the damage value. So let me let all these flies die. Oh, my bad. Okay, I need to I need to take out a room fully with the flies. I see, I see. Okay, so Take out a room fully with all these flies and do not fire. Right, so now all these new flies should be generated at like a hundred and something damage, right? I, I don't know. I don't know exactly if that'll work or not. I'm just spitballing. I think they are. I think they're doing insane damage. 
Another puzzle piece, awesome. Seems to be working, I think. Extra black heart there, why not? Awesome. Oh my god, I love this. I love this a lot. Right, we'll, we'll know for sure if it's worked when we kill the boss here. Eh, maybe not, maybe not. Still though, we're doing good damage. I don't care either way, we're doing good damage. Ooh, fur on. Oh ho ho, I have to take fur on, it's just too good. Um, I do not like standing near all of these though. So I'm gonna take out a few of these so I don't end up getting myself killed. Good, good. Okay, so I think I think I want fur on more than anything else here. Um, I think I probably want to get rid of the food upgrade here. Stop dropping my goddamn trinket. Cool. Um, yeah, I think I'm pretty happy with this. Good. good. Give me that. Even though I'm not firing, I still want first on stuff for later. What a god tier combo. Is there anything we want to re-roll while we're at it? I don't think there is. Look at that. So cool. Ooh. When they get off screen, they go all like slow. Cool. Let's go. Um, yeah, don't think there's anything we want to do with any of these. Let's just keep it moving. Health is looking real good as well because we've not had to take any damage on it. Another one of these, hello. Unfortunately, just a lot of health, which we definitely don't need right now. Bit of extra damage there. Nope, can't take that, unfortunately. Right. And in here we go. Forever alone. I guess I'll take it for the potential transformation, but I don't think I want it. Wait, what? I must certainly want that back, thank you. Don't try and steal my Furton, please. Nice. Everything is dead. Everything is dead when you have spin to win. Man, I just love this. This is just such a crazy combo. <laughs> Look at that. Just insta-killed that boss. Like, actually insta-killed it. And the flies are still kicking it. The flies move pretty quick as well, so... You can do a lot. Who'd have thought I'd be on a run here where I'd... I'd Pretty much don't even have to uh, fire. Didn't know this was mum, but there you go. Probably not gonna be able to keep all of my boys around for this entire fight, but I'll try. I've already lost quite a few of them. I need the foot to stomp me, really. There you go, we got it. Didn't have to fire for that one either. We got fly, iron bar. I. <sighs> There's some good shit here. I want to take Cricket's body because I want to see what it's like with Furton, but also Tech X. Um, I think I'm gonna take this. Um, and I think I'm gonna take. I don't know what I'm gonna swap it for. I think I'm gonna actually gonna swap it for the soybean. You know. I just want to see what this is like. Do you know, I've done this not realizing that I am the lost and have no way out. So if I get hit, I'm kind of fucked. I didn't really think about that. It really didn't come to mind. It probably should have done, because pretty crucial part of this whole 
shtick. I think I get uh, procs on my flies after each wave as well. So I shouldn't actually have to worry too much about losing my flies. Okay, I like Furtong. I'm glad I took this. I don't know if it would have worked with Tech X, but I'm glad I took it like this. Nice. Just need to get enough flies on them to do get the killing blow and then we're good. Luckily we've got enough pentacle little dudes to help us out too. So yeah, we've lost all of our flies here, but we should get them back, I think. Yeah, we do. Good. You're a threat. You do lasers, so you're a threat. To be fair, this attack is also a threat. Dropping spiders on me, I don't like that. Okay, I think we're good. You're dead. Good, good. I'm liking Slick Spade working with us as well. It's real nice. you all dead as well. Don't know how much further we've got to go. It's annoying when all of the flies don't latch and just a few of them do. Like, if all of them latched, the bosses would be dead so fucking quick. Can't really leave spiders alive. They're going to get me killed. Oh god. I didn't realize your brimstone didn't go full length of the room. Weird. Why is, why is my bean item on the floor? Oh, I, I, I gotta say I got rid of it. So wait, what? So why am I leaving linger bean farts around then? I'm still leaving linger beans, look. I don't rightly know. That was confusing. Oh god. Didn't see the stomper coming in. I think we're all good. Laser beams. I love laser beams. Okay, it's been pretty successful so far. Don't think we've got too many ways left. Some of these guys we definitely want to take out from a distance. Anything that can lob explosions or do brimstone at us, mainly. There you go, and we get Band of Regen. Unfortunately, that does absolutely diddly squat for us. So I can't be taking that. We will move on to the next floor. Yeah, this this combo, pretty strong. Pretty strong. Full clear the room with a few fl uh, flies without losing any of them. Oh, dude. There you go. So don't latch onto an enemy that you can't kill. Big sad times. Die, fool. I'm still doing farts. That must be maybe part of Slick Spade then, I guess? 
Unless it's just like latched onto me as an ability and even though the item's gone, I still have the item technically. Some sort of weird glitch with how the item's coded maybe. Good. Third puzzle piece. Puzzle. What? I didn't know a puzzle piece could give you a trinket. Rude. But not not even a good trinket either. It's like, come on. Blasphemous. Good, good. Boss man, where art thou? Three black hearts. We do not need them, but thank you for them regardless. God damn that. That, like, ten times damage shot to start a room off is pretty spicy to actually end a room off with instead. Okay. Keep things moving. Certain rooms I'm just going to do normally because they scare me. Such as this one. This one is one where we can just go like this down the entire aisle and it should just wipe everything. Yep. Same with this one. Oh my god. We did get an angel deal again here. White rose. Um, I mean it's worth picking up. Excuse me, don't, don't drop, don't drop that. I need that. Okay. Keep it moving. Technically, I should be picking up every item at least once. Because I could get a, a Pentacles copy of the item. Worth trying to get that copy. Nice. Hit those enemies, goddamn. That was close, I don't know why I ran into that. That could have killed like well, I don't know if it could have killed me, but it definitely could have hurt me. These little twerps. At least I'm goddamn deleting most things. I love that. Charm of the Vampire? Come on now. I need more keys, I've realised. I suppose I don't really need them, because I'm going to stick with these items that I have now anyways, so... Should check this, though. So you never know. This is the sort of room where, unfortunately, we aren't going to be able to rely on our flies doing everything for us again. We can somewhat rely, but not not the same extent. I mean, maybe to the same extent. Another angel deal here. Angel prism, I'm very curious about. Do you know what? I think this time we can get rid of pentacles and take the prism. I was just about to say, I'm just super curious to see how it looks with this, and I like it. It's nice. It's some good stuff. It also spins around us at crazy speeds, and I kind of love that. Right, um, up we go. Yeah, up we go. This has be a wacky run. I love it when you get this, like, these weird synergies where it's like, yeah, I just don't have to do anything now. Okay, this is a horrible room for us. Absolutely horrible, because we have to wait. Got to be very, very careful here, because an enemy spawned on top of me. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, enemy spawned on top of me. Don't like it when that happens. Flies, go after the enemies that are right in front of you. Don't just sit there like gimps.
Okay. Good, 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 good. We are slapping our way through. Why is every single one of these rooms we've been into so far just been full of goddamn uh, enemies? I've been very unlucky with those thus far. You get the ability to get into them for free and it's like, nah, they're all gonna be crap. That was a really bad hit there. Absolutely no need. Okay, Isaac, how trashed are you about to get? Not, not, not as trashed as I would have hoped. We got him down to halfway, which is obviously lovely, but I was kind of hoping my flies would do a little bit more than that. Dude, my rock gut keeps pulling me. Stop, please. Yeah, second phase. You can see that our actual damage, not that good. Dude, when he's bleeding and he does that teleport away, he technically moves a really far distance and so he takes a massive chunk of damage. Okay, nice kill. Isaac is dead. We've still only got two keys here, but eh, whatever. Probably gonna stick with the items we have anyways. We have to get some really spicy stuff, of which we did not get either. So I'm a little, I'm actually a little bit worried for the uh, Mega Satan fight, because our primary tactic is not gonna work on Mega Satan. So that's a fight that I'm like a bit iffy on. Wasn't expecting a devil deal here. Don't think I'll be taking anything from there. You are dead. You are dead. You are also dead. Can you fuck off? <laughs> Goddamn spinny boys. Nice. Oh, that's a key in there, isn't it? Potentially useful, I'll keep it. Yeah, I gotta say, our actual damage is not gonna be great for uh, fighting off the good old... Blue Baby and Mega Satan, but we'll, we'll try our best, I guess. Pinking Shears, it's pretty good. Good. Analog stick, don't thank. Don't think so. I was going to say, don't thank you then, but no, just don't think so. Okay. Taking care of business. We've also got perfection at the minute, so we're getting a lot of chests, which is rather nice. Don't know what to think of all this. You all need to stop eating enemies. I frozen, nice. <laughs> Very bad hit by me. Another key, good, good. Oh my god, they're all explosive. Fuck. Fuck me. I want an I I wanna find an item that's like an absolutely mahoosive damage up before we fight uh big bosses. Nice. For spin to win to come back up. Get some flies on him. Blast him down. Like when is when has spin to win like ever been a pivotal part of a of a run? 
People that don't know about this are missing the hell out. It's kind of insane. Get extra bombs is nice. I've actually got quite a lot of bombs going on right now. We only need like one fly pair enemy as well and it does the work. Oh God, you can just see how slowly I'm killing stuff the, without the flies. That's my main concern, it's just... Yeah, we're not going to be able to do a lot when it comes to big bosses when we don't have our flies. God damn, give me something better than Bursting Sack, come on. Ugh! The items, they are sacra bleu. Bombs again. And another one of these. Do you know what? I'm going to open another one of these. That's probably pretty good. Um, I'm going to get rid of this bad boy. Yeah, that's good stuff. That's good stuff. I forgot to press space when we entered the room and I lost a bunch of flies. I'm a gimp. We just lost a good bit of damage on this guy. Oh, I've also lost my Holy Mantle already. This probably isn't going to go so hot. I can't knock my bombs like I normally do. I'm going to try my best here, but without any protection, I'm not super... Super keen on how this is going to go. Ah, bugger. That was a fun run regardless. I had a lot of fun. I'm glad we took the uh, the risky route and played as the lost. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.